Good evening. My name is Bob Tremblay, Superintendent of Schools. I wanted to reach out to families and staff this evening as we prepare to come back to the school tomorrow and in the wake of the tragedy in Florida. And I'm sure what's on everyone's mind is about school safety and security. We will continue to do our best work to keep our schools safe and secure. In fact, we have plans for our coming fiscal budget that include improved safety efforts at all of our schools. But the most important work we can do is to spend time developing the relationships that we have in our school. More than ever, mental health needs are paramount for us. And we need to spend time making sure we know our students, that we're taking care of one another and taking an interest in one another to recognize signs when things may not be going so well for our students. It's important that we focus our efforts on our mental health needs of our students, making sure we provide the necessary resources in our schools to meet those student needs. That's the work that's ahead of us. In the coming weeks, uh, as you've probably seen on social media, there's opportunities for students to demonstrate their passions around school safety. We're gonna make age-appropriate opportunities for our students in the Framingham schools, hopefully working with our state legislators to talk with students about how bills can be passed in Congress and what efforts can be taken and to really and truly engage in a community dialogue on this important topic. Well, no amount of security, of door locking and lockdown preparations and ALICE training, which we hope to look at to bring to our district uh, in the coming months. None of that can replace the need for the relationships that we need to make sure we build and nurture in our schools. I ask all of our students who may be listening to this tonight and watching this video to re-engage with one another beyond social media, to talk, to have conversations, to really truly care about one another and to express those feelings in our schools, to really take an interest in one another and to make sure that we are all mindful of what's happening in our hallways and in our classrooms. The more we can attend to the mental health needs and to the general needs of one another, the better our schools will be. I look forward to welcoming you back tomorrow. I hope you had a great uh, break from school for those who are able to take a break. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Have a good evening.